Hi, in this video we're going to be talking about Start Menu X, which is a Start Menu replacement you could use for Windows 11 and also for Windows 10. So if you're not a fan of the Windows 11 Start Menu, you could try this out and give yourself more of a Windows 10 style Start Menu and also do a lot of customizations. So I already have it installed, but I want to show you the page here. So there's the free version, which gives you these features, and then the professional version, which is not free, where you get a couple extra features here. So I got the free or the, yeah, the free work version going here. So like I said, it's already installed. So when you click on Start, you'll see it's looking like Windows 10. And if you really want to have it look like Windows 10, you could put your Start button on the left by right-clicking the taskbar, go into Settings, and go to Behaviors, change this to Left. So now we have it over there, and it kind of looks like Windows 10. And I also changed the color a bit. So you'll notice you have, you know, your Documents, pictures and so on, this PC, desktop, the run command, add items, remove items, run box, power controls, and so on. So it kind of acts like Windows 10 start menu. Actually more like a Windows 7 start menu because you don't have the uh, all the boxes there, the tiles that you have in Windows 10. So when you click on options, you can change some of these things here. So, you know, starting with Windows, open the menu by pressing the Windows key on the keyboard, like that. Personalization, so this is where I change it to the Windows 10 skin. You know, there's different ones. You know, go SpaceX, Black, Aliens, Metro. Christmas. Stick with Windows 10. And then you could adjust uh, system color and width and scale. Then you could change your start button if you want to do something, you know, weird. So right now I'm using a Windows 11 start button. You could do Windows 10 start button. All your controls, uh, which stuff you want to see in the start menu. So these are the default setter check now. So you could add these other ones if you want to do that too. So if we had shut down and restart and log off, let's say. And shortcuts for the program, the style. If you're going to have more Windows 10 style with the tiles, you could do that. Or classic start menu. Some advanced options here. And then to uh, apply the changes, you have to click on restart the program. So now you can see I have the uh, log off and restart and these options down here, which I didn't have before. So once again, it's pretty simple to use. So if you like to customize your uh, start menu, you don't like the Windows 11 start menu, uh, you could install this for free and kind of tweak it the way you like and see how it works. And of course, if you don't like it, you could just either disable it or uh, uninstall it. I'll put a link in the description so you can download it and try it for yourself. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.